Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Before starting the video, if you have not subscribed our channel till now, then please subscribe it. In this video, we will see how to integrate Log4j and Spring Framework. Let's search for Log4j Maven dependency. Let's copy this. Before paste, let's run this, see it's working fine or not. Service started, let's check in the browser. See it's working, as we added in last video system out so system out messages are coming properly. So as you know this is not the right way to print anything in the console, better we should use log4j API. Let's paste the copied dependency. Along with that, we need log4j properties file, let's create one property file. Let's search for log4j property sample file. Go with Oracle link. When you open this link there are so many samples are available. For this time I am just copying the first one and paste it in log4j.properties file. Adding some small changes for this time changing from error to info. Same way users can set another kind of mode like debug and removing some unwanted line of code. Let's run again and see it's working or not. As you can see now there are so many logs are coming, and it's working fine. Now let's add changes in logger aspect class so instead of the system out it should be logger info or debug. For this time I am using info log 4j. As you can see changes looks very simple, and now change system out to logger.info, that's it. Let's run and see it's working or not. It's working fine. Let's review whatever changes we added. I hope you like this video then please subscribe our channel.